Please take a note. Take a child, don't use bad language. Anyone will use a dirty language, I will, I will bounce you. Behave yourself. Your prophet is a cat person. Do you have reference for mine? I really like Christian Prince, but his videos are too long for me to uh, mirror, so I have to copy them with my camera and okay, put them on that okay, way. Listen. So I'll try it still. Okay. Charlie, don't say this statement again, okay? Because it's insulting, okay? Why do you insult the prophet? Let peace be upon it. Okay, now. So, like I told you, in one of the prophet's uh, comments, he said, a woman was in prison, was thrown in, in hell because she mistreated a cat, you know? Mm -hmm. Now you are trying to convince me that Islam encourages violence against women. Why don't you talk about this hadith of the Prophet when he said that a woman was thrown in hell she let her uh, go out. She just imprisoned the cat. She imprisoned the cat. Why don't you talk about things like that? You try to misinterpret certain uh, Ed, you are jumping. Oliver, your prophet he ordered to kill dogs. So can we say that Muhammad, he is from the cat party and he hit dogs? A woman, she will go to hell for mistreating a cat but Muhammad, you order his men to kill the dogs in Mecca and Medina. How do you explain that to me? Secondly, you did not show me yet anything about Muhammad being a cat person. Uh, Muhammad, you say many crazy things. Uh, like you mentioned to me that the woman, she mistreat a, a cat. And... Uh, And because of that, she will go to hell. Right? But according to Islam, women, you know, I mean, sorry, cats are, are, are dirty too, the same as dogs. <coughs> why, why a woman, if she mistreat a cat, but Muhammad, he mistreat a human being, he will go to heaven. As an example, did Muhammad put nails in the eyes of living a human being? That woman, she did not do that. She just, she just tied her up and did not feed her. All right? She will go to hell. Muhammad, he tied them up and he crucified them and he cut their feet and he cut their hands and he put nails in their eyes and he made them die slowly under the heat of the sun and he will go to heaven. Don't you see there's a big uh, the hypocrisy there? Right? There's a big hypocrisy. So how do you explain that to us? Muhammad, he encouraged Muslims to slaughter a human being. But he's saying, be nice to cats, as you said, you're mine. I'm about to read now this hadith of the Prophet. Uh, and I'll try, okay, because all this, it's very emotional. So, forgiven because he was merciful, he dog. You don't talk about that. This is how we treat animals. A man was forgiven. You know? A man suffered from thirst while he was walking on a journey. When he found a well, he, com he climbed down into it and drank from it. Then look, lolling its tongue from thirst, the ground. The man said, this dog has suffered thirst 
just as I have suffered from it. He climbed down into the wind, filled his shoe with water, and caught it in his mouth as he climbed. So Muhammad, he would like to give water to dogs, but he would like to kill them too. Read the hadith for me, open the link. This is Sahih Bukhari, Oliver. Open the link. I will post for you in Arabic and in English. All right? This is the hadith in English. It is a Sahih hadith. The Prophet, he ordered to kill the dogs. So your Prophet, he liked to give them water and then kill them. That's amazing. Correct, right, guys? You see how nice the Prophet is? He liked to give them water. He don't like to see thirsty dogs, but yet he want to kill them. How do you explain that to us? The mic is yours. Read. So that man who was merciful to a thirsty dog, okay, Allah appreciated this deed, so he... I will go with your logic. This is me, Muhammad, he will go to hell. Correct, guys? Is that correct? There's a man, he was merciful to the dog, Allah will take him to heaven. Okay, that's wonderful. Muhammad was not merciful to dogs, so he will go to hell. Here we go, your prophet saying, kill all the dogs. Read it. The man who was merciful to dogs, he will go to heaven, that's what you say. The man who is not merciful, he will go to hell. As I understand from you, Muhammad, he killed the dogs. Why? Your mind. <clears throat> Look, I have never... Okay. I, I don't know about that uh, uh, hadith, honestly. But all I can say is that maybe he's talking about feral... Or... Uh, what do you call it? Uh, stray dogs or... I don't know. Maybe no, no, that's not true. I can show you a story where they went to a, to a, to a guard dog in the house of a woman, and still they, they killed her dog. This woman, she's an old woman, she have a dog in her yard, not outside, to protect her. They killed her, you know? So what's stray dog? What are you talking about? And even Muhammad, there's more hadith speaking about the more details. As an example, Muhammad he ordered to kill black dogs uh, because he hated black people and he, he hated black color. So he said, if you find any animal, actually not only dogs, any Aswadon Bahim, any black, pure uh, black animal, kill him. Any animal, even if it's a horse. If it is a black, pure black, kill him. Do you want me to show you the hadith? You mind? Now, those who don't have voice in Pal talk, maybe, maybe somebody can put my, my, my words guide in text. So they can hear what I'm saying. I mean, they can get what I'm saying. Maybe need to re reinstall Paltalk, you know, or uh, at least start to try to close Paltalk and come back. You know, Paltalk sometimes doesn't function correctly, and uh, you might land in the wrong server. So close Paltalk and come back. If it doesn't work, reinstall Paltalk. Oliver. So, what what you just said to us uh, does not fit, and it's not consistent with with the behavior of Muhammad. Muhammad, he ordered to kill dogs for no problem except uh, their color on being dogs. Like why Muhammad, he ordered to kill black dogs, as an example. Do you know? Black dog, he did not say, he did not say a sick dog, he did not say a dangerous dog. No, he didn't say, he said, kill any black animal you see. What is the purpose of that? Go <coughs> Okay. If killing dogs or center color or whatever, <coughs> why don't you read this? This is a hadith. It was said, O Messenger of Allah, is there a reward for charity even for the animals? The Prophet said, in every living being there is a reward for charity. Why don't you read this? Why don't you discuss it? Why? Or for some Uh, obscure 
obsecure. Uh, who say we are not going? Here we go. I'm giving you a chance to show me. Okay, I will move on to part four. Bye.